In today's fast-paced, tech-driven world, we often take the internet for granted. From the moment we wake up and check our phones to the last email we send before bed, the internet plays a fundamental role in how we live, work, and interact. But have you ever paused to think about how this seemingly magical force enables you to connect with anyone, anywhere, at any time? The ability to stream a video from halfway around the world to instantly send an email across continents or to video chat with someone thousands of miles away happens thanks to an intricate and awe-inspiring system of technology. Beneath the surface of our oceans lies the unsung hero of global connectivity, submarine cables. These cables, which span oceans and connect countries, enable the fast and reliable data transmission that underpins everything from social media to financial transactions. While satellites might seem like the go-to solution for internet connectivity, the truth is that these underwater cables carry 99% of all international data traffic. This article delves into how these cables are made, installed, and maintained, and the critical role they play in the global digital infrastructure. A Brief History – The Origins of Submarine Cables Before exploring the complexities of modern submarine cables, it's worth considering their historical origins. The story of submarine cables began long before the digital age. In fact, it traces back to the 19th century when telegraph cables were laid across oceans to facilitate long-distance communication. The first successful transatlantic telegraph cable was completed in 1866, connecting North America to Europe. Back then, these cables carried simple electrical signals that transmitted telegraph messages. Today's cables carry vast amounts of digital data through fiber optic strands. But the basic concept remains the same. A physical connection between continents enables faster communication. This historical foundation laid the groundwork for the internet as we know it today, transforming the way nations interacted and giving rise to the global communications network we now rely on. Building the backbone of the internet, fiber optic technology. Fiber optic technology lies at the heart of every submarine cable. But how do these delicate strands of glass transmit data at lightning speed across the globe? Fiber optics work by transmitting data as pulses of light. Each fiber strand, thinner than a human hair, can carry vast amounts of information. These fibers are bundled together into cables, which are insulated and protected by several layers of armor to withstand the extreme conditions of the ocean floor. Each fiber strand can transmit data in multiple wavelengths, allowing for a massive amount of information to be sent simultaneously. This is what makes fiber optics the most efficient method for global data transmission. The speed at which data can travel through fiber optics is astounding, nearly the speed of light. This is why it's possible to load a website hosted in another country or stream a video from across the world with little to no delay. Planning and mapping the route, the installation of submarine cables, Installing submarine cables is no small task. The planning process alone can take years. Engineers must carefully chart a course for the cable, taking into consideration underwater terrain, tectonic activity, and artificial hazards such as shipping lanes and fishing zones. Additionally, engineers aim to avoid regions prone to natural disasters like underwater volcanoes and earthquakes, which could damage the cables. Once the route is mapped out, the installation process begins. Specially designed ships, known as cable laying vessels, are tasked with deploying these cables across the seabed. The ship slowly releases the cable as it moves along the predetermined path, carefully placing it on the ocean floor. The depth at which these cables are laid varies. In shallow waters near coastlines, the cables are often buried to protect them from ship anchors and fishing nets. However, in the deep ocean, the wires are laid on the seabed, where they are less likely to encounter human activity. Undersea cables versus satellites, why cables are still king. With the rapid advancements in satellite technology, one might wonder why the world still relies on undersea cables to transmit internet data. While satellites offer impressive coverage, they cannot compete with the speed and capacity of fiber optic cables. One of the biggest limitations of satellite-based internet is latency. Signals sent by a satellite must travel to space and back, resulting in noticeable delays in communication. For applications like video conferencing, online gaming, or financial transactions, 
This delay is unacceptable. Fiber optic cables, on the other hand, offer significantly lower latency, allowing for near instantaneous communication. Furthermore, the bandwidth capacity of undersea cables far exceeds that of satellite systems. As global data usage continues to skyrocket, fiber optic cables are the only technology capable of meeting the ever-increasing demand for data transmission. Laying the Cables, an Oceanic Engineering Marvel The process of laying submarine cables is a marvel of modern engineering. After the route has been carefully charted and mapped, the cable laying ship gets to work. The wires are loaded onto the boat, which can carry thousands of kilometers of cable at a time. The cable laying process must be precise. The ship moves slowly along the ocean, unspooling the cable as it goes. Specialized crew members monitor the process closely, ensuring that the cable is laid exactly where it's supposed to go. In areas where the ocean floor is rough or rocky, remotely operated vehicles, ROVS, may be deployed to help guide the cable. These ROVs can maneuver the cable into position and ensure that it isn't damaged during installation. In shallow waters, the cables are buried several meters beneath the ocean floor to protect them from damage. However, in the deeper parts of the ocean, sometimes at depths of up to 8,000 meters, the cables are simply laid on the ocean bed where they are less likely to be disturbed. The role of repeaters keeping data moving. One of the most fascinating aspects of submarine cables is how data is transmitted over such vast distances without losing signal strength. This is made possible by a device called a repeater. Repeaters are placed at intervals along the length of the submarine cable, typically every 50 to 100 kilometers. Their purpose is to boost the signal as it travels across the ocean, ensuring that data can be transmitted quickly and reliably. Without repeaters, the signal would weaken over long distances, resulting in slower internet speeds and potential data loss. These devices are powered by a small amount of electricity that travels through a separate conductor in the cable. The repeaters amplify the light signals traveling through the fiber optic strands, allowing data to travel thousands of kilometers without any significant degradation in quality. Protecting the cables, natural and human threats. Submarine cables may be marvels of engineering, but they are not immune to damage. Natural disasters such as undersea earthquakes and landslides can break cables, disrupting internet connectivity for entire regions. In 2006, a magnitude 7.0 earthquake off the coast of Taiwan severed several submarine cables, leading to widespread internet outages across East Asia. Human activity also poses a threat. Fishing boats, particularly those using trawling nets, can accidentally damage submarine cables. Ships dropping anchor in the wrong area can drag cables, causing breaks that require time-consuming and expensive repairs. To mitigate these risks, cables are often laid in regions less prone to natural disasters, and in high-traffic areas, they are buried beneath the seabed. Cable operators also use monitoring systems to detect breaks or damage quickly allowing them to respond and repair the cables as soon as possible. Redundancy and backup, ensuring global connectivity. Despite the vulnerability of submarine cables, the global internet infrastructure is designed to be resilient. Redundancy is a key feature of the system. Major data centers in cities are connected by multiple cables, meaning that if one cable is damaged, data can be rerouted through another. For example, cities like London, New York, and Tokyo are hubs of internet traffic connected to multiple submarine cables. This ensures that if one cable is cut or damaged, internet service won't be completely interrupted. In addition to redundancy, major tech companies like Google, Facebook, and Microsoft have invested in building their private submarine cables. These cables allow the companies to control their data transmission routes, ensuring faster and more reliable service for their users. While most of us use the internet every day without thinking about how it works, understanding the infrastructure that makes it all possible is crucial in today's digital age. By learning more about submarine cables, we can appreciate the incredible feats of engineering and collaboration that keep the world connected. Want to stay updated on how the internet's global infrastructure is evolving? Get involved by supporting initiatives that aim to expand global digital connectivity, especially in underserved regions. Stay informed, and help advocate for continued investment in this essential infrastructure.
The future of submarine cables, what lies ahead? The future of submarine cables is bright. As our global demand for data continues to grow, so too will the need for more cables and greater capacity. Thanks to advancements in fiber optic technology, the next generation of submarine cables will be able to transmit even more data. Exciting possibilities are also on the horizon, such as quantum communication, which could revolutionize the way data is transmitted across vast distances. While these technologies are still in their early stages, they offer a glimpse into the future of global communication. However, in the foreseeable future, submarine cables will remain the primary means of internet data transmission. As companies and governments continue to invest in expanding and upgrading the submarine cable network, we can expect even faster and more reliable global connectivity in the years to come the hidden infrastructure that powers our digital world. The internet may feel like an invisible, omnipresent force, but in reality, it is powered by a complex and vulnerable network of submarine cables lying deep beneath the world's oceans. These cables, which stretch for thousands of kilometers, are the backbone of global connectivity, enabling everything from social media to international financial transactions. As we continue to rely more heavily on the internet in our daily lives, the importance of this infrastructure will only grow. Whether it's laying new cables, improving existing ones, or exploring new technologies, the future of global connectivity is an exciting frontier. By understanding and appreciating the technology that powers the internet, we can better support efforts to expand digital access to all corners of the globe, ensuring that everyone can benefit from the remarkable power of global connectivity.